um, get to. <sighs> so hot. Okay, I think I'm sorted. Just for a little while, we're getting real close to where my mom and dad Not are. Not now, Clementine. Maybe I can... Not now, Clementine. Maybe later, okay? Okay. How's Oni? His leg's pretty bad. I'm fine. You're not fine. You need to rest. He needs to rest. Right, let's yeah, stop. Right. Kenny, hold up. Kenny, God damn it! I said hold up! Omid needs to take a break. Let's give him a minute. We're almost at the river. Almost to the boats. Then it won't hurt to stop for just one damn minute. What the hell? Maybe this city's not so dead after all. Keep moving. No one's ringing that bell. It's automatic. On a timer. What kind of church bell goes off at 20 past the hour? Someone's up there! Are you sure? I don't see anything. I know no what I saw. saw. I'm telling you there's someone up in that bell tower. Someone alive! If I were you, I'd get out of the street now. I thought you said that thing didn't work. Who was the Who leader the hell is this? this? Answer me. What the hell was that? Is someone trying to fuck with us? Sounded more like a warning. Ask not for whom the bell tolls. What are you yammering on about? It tolls for thee. Better help him quick. 
What the hell? God damn it. Oh, missed. Oh, sensitivity is bad. Yes, yeah, so, oh, yes, Chuck. Move your asses! River Street's right up ahead! That's not all. I'll give me a fucking break! Wait, where the hell's Chuck? Chuck. Shit, he's in trouble. We gotta help him. There's no time. We gotta go now. I help him in time. Just go. Come on. opened up your wound. You're bleeding. Shit, it's gonna get infected. We've gotta get him inside. Clean him up. Kenny, how's that door coming? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll work faster, would you? Won't be long before those things outside figure out where we <sighs> went. You know they can smell blood. Lady, I ain't the one who's bleeding. Just, Just get us inside. inside. I don't care how you do it. Maybe you should come up with some ideas then. Um, all right. Talk then. How's he looking? I'm all right. You're not all right. You've reopened your wound, you're losing blood, and God only knows what might have gotten in there. It could be infected, it could be... No offense, but you really need to work on your bedside manner. Krista's right. She's right. Looks pretty bad. You're as bad as she is. I'm telling you, it's just a... Ah, oh, Jesus! Quit trying to be a tough guy, Ovid. Hell, I'd be crying like a baby my leg looked like that. Please, we have to get him inside. Don't worry. I'm on it. Are we? Guess we are. What's this? Looks like there's some kind of pet door here. I tried it already. That's locked too. Who the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? I have. My neighbor had one just like that. It's it's radio controlled. The dog wears a collar with a chip in it, so the door only opens when the dog gets close to it. Well, shit. Every day's a school day. All right. So, where's the dog? Okay. Where's the dog? I'm guessing it's buried because why is there a shovel here? The shovel is never not useful. In here? Empty. No. Okay. Grave. Must have belonged to someone. Dig. Hey, be careful. Digging up dead things isn't what it used to be, you know what I mean? Yeah, I hear you. What's buried down there? No, I'm guessing this is a dog because everyone's circling around me now. It's been here a while. It's been here a while. You, I can smell it from here. Gross. Clementine, honey, come sit with me and I'll need. Let Lee work. Oh, God, the smell. I can't 
get it off. Okay, that is not cool. Are you okay? Oh, I need to feel sick as well. Oh, all right. It's just the smell. Are you sure you? I said I'm fine. Okay. Jeez Louise. Also, chat after um, I bought the Ghost of Tsushima as well, but I won't be playing Ghost of Tsushima until I've got a completed off stream, and then I play it on stream for you lot. Yes, God damn. You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. Okay, let me see if I can reach up in there. Be careful, man. Okay, mm. just a little bit. So good, I can't get it. Here, let me try. I think I can. Clem inside. No. Clem, God damn it! Get back here, Clementine! Clem inside. Oh. Alive. Good work, Clem. Don't go shooting off like that without asking first, okay? I was just trying to help. I know, and you did good. You just had me worried there for a minute. Can we maybe have this conversation inside? My leg's starting to hurt like hell. Looks okay from here. Everybody in. No, it's okay. I'm good. I feel better already just being off my feet. Thanks, babe. So, when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth sharing with I the rest of us? I only found out yesterday. I was gonna tell you. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. Who gives a shit about the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that and then try to warn us about it? How much sense does anything make anymore? In case you haven't noticed, there's a lot of twisted folks out there these days. At least the dead don't play games with them. Oh, shit. Sorry. I'm just trying to sort something Look, out we with just stay here the commands. Omid needs rest, and we need to wait for the walkers outside to thin out. Suit yourselves, and I'm not going to wait around too long for someone else to grab up those boats. That's our ticket out of here. Place seems secure at least. I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need to check the Okay, that's house. the one. Okay, calm. <sighs> All right, fine. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door. Understand? Okay. Is there anything I can do? Thanks. I got it. Hang out with Chris and Omid until I get back, okay? Lee, I'm sorry. What for? Going through the door like that without checking first? I guess that was pretty dumb, huh? Just ask me first the next time you're gonna outsmart all the grown ups, okay? Okay. Okay. Weird. Nothing. Water 
fingers off. I'm not that hungry. Besides, I need to finish checking the downstairs. Must have stopped working a while ago. Probably not the best idea right now. I need to stay frosty. Yes, so we do. We just have to check downstairs. Hey guys. How's the house looking? Not done searching the first floor yet, but so far so good. How's that couch though? treating you, Omi? Leg feeling better yet? I'm all right. I feel you. Sit tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Thanks, Lee. Yeah, but this doesn't count as a floor. the row as well. It's what we need in this time and age. Not exactly my style. Same cut, same bit. All clear in here. Just one more to check. Just one more to check, and they look this way for me. ain't got much. We should be okay here for a while, at least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. Is he okay? Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? Nah, uh, just dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Clementine. Honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee? Lee, you need to get up here now. What's what wrong? It's Kenny. Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. It's up there? I can't get him to come down. Stay here. Kenny, don't shoot. I'm coming up. Imagine if Kenny just shot then as well. Kenny? Jesus, what the hell is that? Oh my god. Duck. 
What? I thought he died. Kinda looks like Duck, don't he? It's just a kid. What the hell happened to him? Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out up here. Starved to death. Jesus Christ. I don't know if I can, Lee. Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. I'll I can't take care of this, man. I'll take care of it like I did before. Are you sure? I guess yeah. we'll find out. Poor kid must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death. This could have been Clementine if I hadn't found her when I did. True. Let's bash. Oh, well, there's shot, but I'm that's one. should bury him. I'll take care of it. Surprised the lead didn't fall down. This memorial. Rest in peace. Sad music. Why did it cut to that screen? <gasps> what the fuck? Standing there by the fence, watching us. A walker? No, too fast. Took off like a bat out of hell when I spotted him. Was it a man or a woman? Didn't get a good enough look. What does it matter? I'm wondering if it's the same guy who's been following us. The guy on the radio. Might be. 
Jimmy? I'm fine. I just... I'm fine. I saw the ruckus. Lee saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I can't be sure. They ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Me either. Walkers are one thing, but the thought of someone out there actually stalking us. All right, that's it. We've stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Time to get down to the river and find ourselves a boat. I don't know if Omid's well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready, because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And Let's as soon look as she's ready to go, we're moving out. We only checked the house to make sure it's secure. We didn't really toss the place. We're low on food, water, meds, ammo. We should make sure there's nothing here we can use before we move out. You search it if you wanna. I'm done with this house. We came to this city to find a boat, and that's just what I'm gonna do. Maybe it's not such a bad idea to check the place where I more... said I'm done with this house. Fine, Kenny. We can do both. Ben, you take one last look around the place. Grab anything that looks useful, while me and Kenny go down to the river to get us a boat. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. Crimson, stay here and I, I help. think it'd be best if you stayed here with Ben. I need you to watch well, out I, for Omid and no. Mr. Help no, stay here with Ben. Out. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. Watch out for um, Krista and Omid. Who cares about that? For the good of the group. Hey, don't worry. I'll be back before you know it, okay? Okay. Daylight's burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if Omid needs anything. So, you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? Stay not how it is, Ben. I need Clementine. you to stay here and keep an eye on Clementine. I can do that. Well, just so we're clear. While I'm gone, anything or anyone tries to get inside this house, you shoot them. Don't even think twice about it. Understand? I got no problem shooting walkers. Did you hear what I said? Anything or anyone? Good. Hold on. Okay, I just have to change headset. The other ones would make me sweat behind the ear because it's hot in the UK. Talk. So, you want to talk about it? About what? About what happened back there in the attic. No. You sure, man? I mean, river's right up ahead. <laughs> Son of a bitch. That bastard's fucking with us again. It's another trap. No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further <laughs> on. Whatever it is, it's going to get the dead moving over there. is going on shush Kenny maybe they're doing us a favor person ringing that bell might be doing us a favor whatever man I find whoever's doing that I'll ring their motherfucking bell for him good one hmm. let's keep moving
Still nothing moving behind us. I think we're Okay. Oh my god. No. The boats are destroyed. Uh, I don't think so. Maybe we need to come up with a new plan. This is the plan. It's the only one we've got, and you pissing on it in front of everyone like you did back at the house ain't exactly helping. Screw you. I ain't giving up that easy. Screw me! Calm down. This one might still be salvageable. This boat is Kim, fucked. Get a grip. This boat is totally fucked. Oh yeah? Know a lot about boats, do you? Yeah. I'll tell you what, if I ever need an expert opinion on American history or on committing murders, I'll be sure to ask. But how about you leave the nautical shit to me? Oh, do you want to get drowned in that water, huh? It looks like a pretty I'll rough tide. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. <sighs> okay. Fine. Even though I'm the leader of this group, but whatever. That's a quarter to work. Uh, what the hell? Fuck. This is meant to be some kind of stay out. Do something like this. Everyone, Lee. If I shoot, then I'm bringing the walkers back, so I ain't gonna do that. Oh, cash, rest cash register must have fucking um, sub coins. Hello, beautiful. Empty. No. Yeah. Been too easy. How? Okay, what else could have coins? Maybe a newspaper stand? Quarter? What? Is that a quarter or a dollar? No, I don't know. I don't know about American bloody coins. Fuck! What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. Hull's cracked beneath the waterline, Was well, someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? What the... What the hell is that? A fate worse than death. Abandoned, like every other place in this city. Salvageable. Boat there as well. Nothing but water. Not a boat to be seen. What the? What the hell? Who is that? Get down! Get down! Someone's here. Why the hell are we hiding? Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? Sounds like a plan. Okay, you head up the middle of the street. I'll go around the side, cover your flank. 
will come up on him quiet, taken by surprise. We just want to talk to this guy. Oh, we're gonna talk. Well, we're gonna talk, yeah? Why have you got your gun out? What the? Oh shit. I did press R2 but it didn't want to work. She's wearing a face mask, why can't any of you? Crawford. What the hell are you talking about? Kenny. Kenny, don't! No, he's with us! Oh, for the idols, the walkers. Who the hell are you people? I asked you first. I asked you first. The name's Molly. Molly? I'm Lee. This is Kenny Clementine. I'm not looking for any trouble. Hi. Hi. You guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? I'm from Macon. I'm from Macon. Kenny here's from Florida. She didn't ask for our life stories, Lee. Shut up, Kenny. Deal with this Crawford place. You sure you want to know? When everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive, stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero-tolerance policy for anyone who won't, or can't, live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Because there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. Who's been ringing those been bells? Ringing those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. I knew it! Lee, I knew she was the one who'd been following us! Fucking with us! Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. Oh. I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raise the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the areas they cleared out. Walkers. Geeks. Is that what you call them? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival, they'll eat anything, alive or dead. That's pretty smart, the bears. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. You just gotta move fast, get in and out before they start to wander back again. What's that you were out there? Was that you house this morning? Watching me through the back fence? Hell no. Believe it or not, I've got better things to do with my time. Wasn't her. Clem, what the hell are you doing here? How'd you get out of the house? Oh, well, Mead started getting really sick. Kristen and Vin had to take him upstairs. I didn't just want to sit around there. I wanted to come help. I told you we didn't need any help. Um, you could have got yourself because killed. Because if it weren't for her showing up when she did, I would have beaten your brains out. True. That's debatable. Uh huh. Why no children? No children. Why not? No children, no elderly, no one with an advanced medical condition. 
Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Crawford's all about the survival of the fittest. That's how they survived, while the rest of the world went to shit around them. Jesus Christ. Well, just the opposite when you think about it. What did Crawford do to them? What happened to them? Well, you met some of them already. What the hell? Yeah, anyone who got sick, anyone too old, anyone they figured wasn't strong enough to survive. To them, those people were just mouths to feed, a drain on their precious resources. Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except this one was true. Look, I'm gonna ask you people again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? What are you doing here? I need to get back to the house. Just want to get her back home. We're not going anywhere until I find us a goddamn boat. Yeah, good luck with that. Anyone with a boat? And I'm protecting Clementine, asshole. Any that got left behind, Crawford stripped them for parts. Cars too. There's got to be something. If there was, do you think I'd still be here? I've been over every inch of this city. This whole place is picked clean. God damn it! Fuck! Hey, moron! You want to keep your voice down? Shit. Since you're not getting on any boat, I'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before. Those come. Great. Just wait. Isn't that the way we came? Fuck. Gunshot must have brought him back. Yeah. Idiot. Bob, is there a. Wow. Part of our conversation where you became my problem. Don't leave us here, please. Yes, Clem. You should puppy dog eyes. Come on, make it fast. Yes, Clem. Keep us safe. Oh, fuck you, Kenny. And why is Lee fucking just walking instead of running? Up then, X won't work in. Go! That was close. That was very close. Holy shit. Clementine, can you hear me? Clementine? If you can hear me, just get back to the house, okay? I'll meet you there. Shit. Guess in this way. Go down. Let's go down this way. I was just about to say, 
How has he not slipped yet? That's water. Okay. Try it. Could be the way out. Oh, no way I could take on all of those things by myself. Yes. Uh, turn left, lefty Lucy right eye. Don't turn anymore. No. Learn that from mechanics, people. No, but I need this wheel, don't I? Seems loose. Oh shit! Shit! Oh! Up. Pox, so that keeps that running. Okay, not that way, Lee. There you go. Can I have a better camera? Alright, pry then. Oh shit. That was loud. Okay, 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 okay. Go! I'll try to get on that metal grating. And turn... Left. Oh, Don't turn anymore in that direction. Turn right. Okay, I'm guessing I'm gonna have to run back. Oh shit. Wait, is that who I think it is? I just saw an old man with grey beard. Okay, wait. Is that it? Yes, it is. No, what are you doing? Lee. Fucking hell. It's Chuck. Must have tried to hide out down here. Poor bastard. No bullets. He must have saved the last one for himself. You deserve better, old man. Man. Boom. 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 Oh shit. Let's go. Damn, I 
Can't reach it. The other side, there's a hole. old nuclear fallout shelters. Look all that food. All this. It's enough to keep people alive for months. Open. Who are you? I don't it's want any right. trouble. It's okay. Uh, I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Uh, which is why you'd do well to turn around and leave right now. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he goes back there and they find out we're down here. Are you from Crawford? They don't lie to me. I know. Where no. else can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. I'm not I'm from around here. here. I'm from Athens. I grew up in Macon. I have a brother in Macon. You were there? How was it? As bad as here? I'm sorry. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever showed us. Think, Vernon. What do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here, right under their feet? Damn it. You're right. I'm sorry, friend. Can't take the risk. Let's Look, talk about this. I want to do this. Let's talk, okay? What's to talk about? You won't even tell us who you are. My name is Lee. I'm a history professor. I don't want to die today. And I don't think you want to kill me either. Don't. Don't come any closer, or I'll shoot. You won't. Come on. Let's just talk about this. Vernon, what are you doing? You shoot have him. no guts! Nobody needs to get shot. Just take it easy. It's all right. It's okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? Vernon! Relax. I'm not here to hurt you. You're really not from Crawford? No. No! Really not. Well, we are, or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place. You know, started weeding out the sick and the old so the perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. No room for weakness or vulnerability in their little master race. You don't look that old, so you're sick? We're sick. We're all members of a cancer survivors group that used to meet here at the hospital. We're in remission. But that wasn't good enough for Crawford. They'd already rounded up five of us before the rest of us managed to hole up and hide from them down here. This old basement's been abandoned for years. What is this? A more? Oh. Yeah, irony's always high on my list when I'm looking for a place to survive. How did you find your way down here? Wolf. A few of us got boxed in by walkers up on the street. Came down here trying to get away. Now I just want to get out of here and get back to my own people. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. Oh, can you show me the way back? Like damn maze. Any chance you could help me find my way back? Look, I'd like to help you, but we've all got our own problems. Two of our group are sick and need constant care, and I'm the only doctor here. You're a doctor? Besides, why should we help you? I have Look, to get back to Clementine. Sorry if I scared you. I just want to get back to my people. Back to Clementine. She's your daughter? No. No. She lost her real parents. I'm doing what I can. Do not seriously considering going with him. It's all right, Bree. I had a daughter too. Lost her in the first days. I'll be damned if I'll just sit back and let that happen to someone she else. She ain't my daughter. I need you here. 
Don't worry. I'll be back before you know it. Let's go. Okay, yeah, just keep shaking your heads. Yep, that's great communication now. Clementine? Clem? Clemmy. Where's Clementine? Molly? Oh, hey, you made it back. Who's this? He didn't tell you about me? Understandable, I guess. I'm the one who put that beating on him when he tried to jump me back at the river. He's a fossil. Where's, Where's Clementine? Clementine's doing the one. Relax. I got her and Kenny both back safely. You're welcome, by the way. Thank you. I think you have something that belongs to me. Thank God you're back. Krista, what's wrong? It's Omid. He's gotten worse. Much worse. We have a man wounded. Who's this? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. Oh, thank God. Could you take a look at him? You don't have you to. You have to help us. Please. Krista, but the fuck off. I'll see what I can do. Take me oh, to him. Good. You're gonna be all right. Lee brought a doctor. All right, let's take a look at him. I work better without an audience. I'm sure you have more things of your own to attend to. Clementine. Clementine? Open. Please be there. Clementine, you in here? Where is she? Clem, you in here? Clementine, where are you? Clem's drawings, but where is she? Exactly. Where is she? Clementine? Don't play hide and seek with me. I'll have time to rest later. I thought she'd be hiding underneath it. Clementine, you door. here? Hello? Molly again. What are you doing? Oh, you know. Just poking around. You won't find anything. We already searched the place. You'd be surprised what people miss. Trust me, I've been doing this for a while. Where's Clementine? Don't ask me, I'm not her keeper. Hey, do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. Why don't you go bug them? She was downstairs. Let's go downstairs. Um. Clem? Clementine. Clementine? Clementine! Come out! Please! Kenny? 
Oh, hey, you made it back. Good job. Good job. What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Where'd you get the bottle? Found it. Found First good it. thing that's happened since... Kitty. Give me the bottle. Kitty, give me the damn bottle. Get the fuck away from me. Getting wasted's not gonna help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked. We're not Molly fucked. Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us. That crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? Man, I don't know what it is. Clementine, where are you? She outside. Please tell me you're outside, Clem. Clementine? Clementine! Clementine. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. Come look. Look what I found. Good work, Clem. Krista, how Krista, are you holding up? I'm okay. Vernon did what he could for all me, but he's got a real infection and he's running a hell of a fever. I'm worried if we don't get some real medicine in him soon. Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Sure. Well? You want the good news or the bad news? Uh, the good news. We could all use some good news. Good news is the boat's seaworthy enough. In pretty good shape, mostly. Mostly? That's the bad news. Gas tank's empty, and her battery's dead. We need to fix both before she's taking us any place. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? What about Crawford? Like Crawford is the one place that has everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Now hold on a minute. 
Surely we have to try. If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man, might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. Please sneak in. There's got to be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. That's actually not the worst idea I've ever heard. I mean, it's close, but I don't know. Maybe it could work. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, it's decided then? We're going to Crawford? We can Let's do, do it. I know it. Hell yeah, we can. Are we seriously talking about this? I mean, what about the risk? I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Oh. Right. We should go tonight, under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. I told you to stay in your room. How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? Is what going to be dangerous? Crawford. Maybe. I can't lie to you. Just say yes. Yeah, it's going to be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better. And get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? I don't want anyone else to die. Hoover do I? Sometimes we have to take that kind of risk. I guess I should go get ready. Oh, uh, say what now? Yeah, we'll say you what said now? You need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Yeah, but Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? Yeah, but. It's dangerous for it's children. Just too dangerous for children especially. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. Oh crap! Don't do this to me. I'm just trying Can't to I keep you safe. You? <sighs> She's giving me the puppy dog eyes. I'm gonna. Uh, yeah. Okay. You can come, but you have to promise to stay quiet and do exactly what you're told the whole time we're there. Okay. I'm gonna go get ready. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So, we're gonna have a capacity problem. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, there ain't gonna be room for everyone. What are you trying to say? Just giving you a heads up is all. Thought you ought to know. 
Yeah, because I'm the leader. Who is she? I don't know. Who the hell is this? This is Bree. She can help us. How? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the way. Your help is in and out fast. Anyone have a problem with that? I'm just tired and hot. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. Hold up just a sec. You ready? Ready. Hey, whoa, hold on a minute. You're not taking her with us. Did you not hear anything I said about the kind of place Crawford is? She can help. If you take her in there and they find her... This little girl's not just excess baggage. She's gotten us out of a tight spot more than once. She's coming. Deal with it. You heard the man. Let's move out. She wants to come. Um. Yeah, I guess I'll take that. This should be it. We're right underneath the center of Crawford. The old school should be directly above us. Okay, people. This is it. Remember the plan. We stay quiet, we stay hidden, and we stay together. We find what we need, and we get the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Got it? Got it. And that part about staying close. Same on three. One, two, three. That's pretty safe so far. This just looks like the road that we were just on. At the beginning of the episode. There should be guards patrolling. What? Are you disappointed? It's just strange, is all. I think I see one. Over there by the door. Okay. Me and Kenny will sneak out trying to take him out quiet. The rest of you wait for our signal, then follow us over. Everybody got it? Right behind you. What the fuck? What the hell? Oh, they're all here now. What the fuck is a walker doing inside here? Get inside, fast! Come on, Clementine. That's she said. I think they did. Definitely. Definitely. Come on. What the hell happened here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. What always happens, I guess. In the end, the dead always win. Oh man, we are so screwed. No, this is good. How is this good? What? How the fuck is this good? Before, everyone in Crawford was smart and they had guns. Now they're dumb and they don't. Hey, trying to look on the bright side here. I agree. So long as we don't let them box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. 
Do you even have any idea how many of them are out there? No. You want to do a head count? No clue. Or do you want to get what we need and get the hell out of here? Mad. Come on. I think I know which way to head. I got a bad feeling about this. Just keep moving. Fine. Here. Looks okay. Everybody in. <sighs> Sorry. Armored figures. <sighs> Looks like they were using this room as some kind of command center. Okay, so now what? Where do we start looking? I don't know. Here. Okay. Just give me a sec. Okay. <sighs> Shit. Battery. Any idea where we could find a battery? Maybe at the auto shop. There used to be one in the alley outside the fire escape. Yep, it's called Herman's. You can't miss it. Medicine. Where would be the best place to look for medicine? Right here. Nurse's station. They were using it as a medical facility. How do you know that? <sighs> Just makes sense, doesn't it? What about the fuel? Where should I start looking? There's a maintenance shed across from the playground here. If they were storing fuel, that's probably where it'll be. Okay. I'll make the run to the maintenance shed for the fuel. It'll be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. I'll come too. No, two people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. We might need to shoot our way out of here. I'll go for the medicine. I'll come with you. I know what to take. Okay. Guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. I'll go with you. Watch your back. Okay, we've got a plan. Everyone be careful. Stay close to one another. We'll all meet back here. Good luck. What about me? What can I do? I need you to stay here with Ben and watch over our command center. I'm putting you in charge of it, okay? You're leaving me with Ben? I'm not leaving you with Oh no. I'm leaving him with you. Understand? Oh, okay. Back before you know. Sorry. Something just doesn't look right with my let's go. Uh, 
Uh, where she go? Oh, principles of oh, Crawford. to the auto shops down here. You coming or not? Oh, I'm just going that way. Show patience tape. I've already been fired. They're worthless. You out here? Guess I'm not going that way. Um, deliveries made in rear. In rear. Rear. Yeah. Authorized motor. What was that? Did you see that? I'm guessing somehow I'm supposed to oh hurry up. Oh. I don't really either. Um. Leave him! He's mine. Uh, nice to see nice you. Nice to see you. Oh. No. Okay, he's, uh, he, um, he's already dead. Molly? I think, I think you got it. One more. He's wearing medical scrubs. Some kind of scientist or doctor, maybe? Yeah, well, he ain't shit now. Did you find us a way in? Yeah, but the garage door's jammed. Can't raise it. Not a problem. Look what I found. Oh yeah, that'll work. No oh, shit. Gus and X. Yes. Go, 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 go,
You, everyone saw his hand move, right? It is hot, hot, hot. Take a look around. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. Uh, yeah, thanks. Well, I can see where the battery should be, but it's not. Perfect. Maybe this one? Looks like it's the holes for the lift hydraulics. No power. Um, pry. Don't think I can pry that hose apart with just my hands. Maybe if I had something to cut it with. You have that uh, mache thing. No? Oh, alright. Let me ask her for her pry thing. Something you need? Ah, uh, can I borrow your hook? Borrow that uh, hook thing of yours? I don't know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. Hilda? That's what I call her. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow Hilda? I'll take good care of her. She won't get a scratch. I got your promise now. Not a scratch. Yes, ma'am. Okay, Poncho. I did it. Yeah, but too fast. Shit. Probably not good. No shit. I'll try to hold him off. Hurry. There's the battery. Finally, something goes right. It's all. I don't know why I have to go there. Got that one off. Got the battery. Got yeah, but we still got a problem here. Put it in here. I'll carry it. Are you sure? Okay, bloody, follow me. That's bloody heavy. Alright. Move your ass! Come on, Lee. <sighs> that was close. Okay. Uh, shoot. Uh, what about me? Oh. Oh, she's strong. Wow, stronger than Kenny. Okay, so now we're on the roof. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. Oh, hell no. Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump. No, of course, me. Chicken. But now that you mention it. Yeah. I hate heights too, Lee. Oh, Lee. Lee. Fucking hell. I wasn't ready for that. Oh, it's hot. I'm Come back on. in. Later. Something I gotta do first. What? Yeah, but you got the battery. You later. Wait, you still got the battery? Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. See you back in class. Molly! You! Damn it, what the hell is she doing? Thing. Okay, so I'm guessing 
I need the combination. You guys need any help? Thanks, but I think we're almost in. We're taking care of it, Lee. Don't worry. Yeah, so can you hurry up or Just, I don't know what I'm supposed to do now. I've forgotten when I played this the first time. Oh wait. Uh oh. Must be the guy who ran this place. Live within the Looks rules. Like he figured himself as some kind of supreme leader. my hatchet. pretty good too great work Kenny how you doing with that door not so good here let me give you a hand Did you get that battery yet yeah Molly has it she should be back here soon she'd better be talk to Bree hey Lee Thanks for all your help back there. I don't think we would have made it without you. No problem. We're all on the same team. How long have you known Werner? A couple of years. He ran our support group. He was really great helping me come to terms with my disease. But how do you come to terms with something like this? With a place like Crawford? I don't know what I or, or the other survivors would have done without Vernon. He's the one who held us together. Kept us alive. So you're a cancer survivor. Like Vernon and the others. Yeah, I was diagnosed when I was in college. Been getting treatment ever since. Just when I was starting to get better, and I thought there might be some hope, all this happened. Lost my whole family. I'm the only one who survived. Funny how things work out, huh? I'd better be okay. gone. Got some things to do. Good luck. Right, so I need to go and do the nurse's thing, right? You okay, Clem? Yeah. This desk is just like the ones we have in my school. I know it's weird, but I kind of miss it, being in school. Really? Yeah. yeah. I would have thought school would be the last thing you'd miss about all this. No, I liked it. Huh. What was your favorite subject? History? Well, what do you know? Mine too. Oh, well, it's you fine. were a history Take teacher. Her to air. She'll be back soon. I hope she's okay. She'll be fine. She's pretty tough. Do you think things will ever be normal again? Just like the way they were before? Uh, I, I think so. It may take a while, but yeah, I do. Don't you? I hope so. That's good. You hold on to that hope. It's the one thing none of this can take away. Let's go and check on the door.
What do we still need? We already got the fuel and the battery. Once we find some medicine, we'll be good to go. So Fisher. where's this battery you found? Molly has it. She ran off to do something. Well, she'd better bring it back here. I don't know why you trusted that girl with it. We hardly know her. She <laughs> saved your life, didn't she? <laughs> yeah, but what has she, she done for me lately? Yeah, but she saved your life, Kenny. No, wait. There is something you can help me with. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. This again? It's my fault Duck and Katja got killed. If I hadn't screwed up back at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something like that around? I have to tell him. Are you fucking nuts? Have you lost your motherfucking mind? Kenny's barely hanging on. You tell him you're to blame? I don't even want to think about what he might do. I know. I thought about that. But I don't know how much longer I can keep looking him in the eye. I feel like I'm lying to him by not telling I'm him. I'm telling you, man, it's a bad idea. Real. Real bad. Hey, maybe you're okay walking around with somebody's blood on your hands, but that's not who I am. I can't just pretend it never happened. I don't pretend. Look, we need uh, so we need him to hold at least I don't run away from protecting people. You need to keep this to yourself for the good of everyone. You hear me? I hear you. I'm gonna get back to this. Let's just go back to the medicine place. I should be open. I oh, fucking hope so. It was my <laughs> sorry. Oh, whoa. Shit. Hmm. Kaboom. What the hell happened? They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the meds? Did we find what we need? Yeah, it's our other problem. Take a look. Oh, keep her. Looks like boat. they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe, locked up tight. There's no way we, we busted bust it open. open. Maybe with enough time. I don't know how much of that we have. It'd be a hell of a lot quicker if we just knew the four-digit combination. Well, I doubt they just wrote it down and left it here for us to find. We should just try busting it open. We don't have any other choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. Oh shit, um... Bed... Up here. Medical file. Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient here. And what's this? A tape. But have we got a 
tape recorder. Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547, Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh, no. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. That you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm gonna give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure! I want my baby! I can't he do it! He pressed this middle bottom. Yeah, you don't have a well, choice. Now, if you middle like, second bottom. time with this, but I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. Hmm. Damn it, we almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Maybe you should search it. See what he's got on him. Oh, I have to go back out there. I don't really want to go back out there. Fine. They look so serious. What did you get it? Oh, mad. It's going to break, it's going to break. <sighs> he crawled. Search. This might be just will cool. be. What's this? Looks like some kind of code. Logan. Logan said the safe combination was only four numbers. Shit, time to go. the thing we looked at earlier. Logan, the 
This must have been his locker. Oh. So it was locked before, but now it's open. And back over here. found two more tapes. One of them is dated October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive? To keep on living? If this is what it takes. If this is what it's turned us into. I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you. Please, help me. Maybe one day, when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. Bum, bum, bum. More importantly, we got the combination. Crystal, What's wrong? Right? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. All right. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. We're in business. Antibiotics, morphine. We take as much of this as we can carry. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You know, I found a third tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We got the meds for me. That's all I care about. We'll head back to the classroom. Don't take too long, Lee. Christ! Oh, you scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take that battery down. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. I'm just kidding. Here you go. What's that? Nothing. Sure there's nothing you want to tell me? Yeah, I'm sure. Are we done? What the hell? I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. Yeah. Spooked by those bells. Where's Clementine? And then I heard someone coming. Did you leave Clementine alone? No, Kenny's with her. We still can't open that armory door. You sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Oh, you fucking Where? idiot. Where did you get that? I just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. 
Oh, you are a fucking knobhead, aren't you? Yes, Molly. Oh. No. That wasn't me. It wasn't me. Come in time. I'm proud of you, Clem. Calm down. Calm down, man. You little pissant! You're fucking dead! You hear me? Dead! My wife and child! You got a both fucking killed! Kenny, I said calm the fuck down! Nice group you got here. Not the time, Molly. If this know, asshole right? thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! You hear me, shitbird? You can stay behind and fucking rot! Kenny, we'll sort this out later. After we get out of here, okay? Ain't nothing to sort out. I just told you the way it's gonna be. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's gotta get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here. Well, I vote we leave it. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to Omi, and you put that at risk. Wait, don't I get a vote? Of course you do. Of course you do. Ben's nice. He's my friend. We don't leave friends behind. That's my vote. On second thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. Lee? Uh, I've seen enough of Crawford to know that becoming like them is the beginning of the end. I vote Ben stays with us. I can't upset. Clem. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a second? No. Oh shit. Now can we go? Damn right. Vernon, come on. That is some gruesome death, you know. No, I'm gonna lie, that's some gruesome death. Oh, she saw her intestines. Oh. Much for the armory. What's left of it? A few rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I could. The lock was busted. Yeah, Just someone kicked it open. Come on. There's got to be a way out down here. Oh, shit. Fuck! It's not going to hold. Back upstairs. Look! Oh, me. Oh, 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 shit.
Oh, you're kidding me. No, I shot. Apparently the shoot doesn't work in this game. Shooting doesn't work, okay. Hi. Hi. Okay. I'll turn right more in again. <sighs> oh, they need to learn. Press R2, it should work straight away. Not wait a couple of seconds. Press it again. Press it again. I actually have to tap it three times for it to work. Saying that and go. Ah! He said it. Not me. I didn't go to him going, I'm gonna kill you and drop you. That was a lot of walkers. Krista? Everything okay? Oh, me! Oh, me's dead. Oh, shit. Sorry. I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him. <sighs> hey. Back already? Yeah. We got you medicine. Good. 
feel like I could use some. Where's Ben? He... What happened? Dumb son of a bitch nearly got us all killed. Lee stepped up and did what he had to. That's what happened. No. Thanks a lot. You did the right thing. Trust me. She no. Understand. I did it because he asked me to let him go. I'm gonna go start work on the boat. It's his last okay. dying request. With a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on it. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes, thank you so much. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. <sighs> thank you for your help. Thank you for all you've done for us. You're welcome. I'm glad Bree will have died for something <laughs> meaningful. You want to know the worst part? What? I don't feel much. I mean, I don't feel enough. Shouldn't I be broken up over what happened to her? That's how I was when I lost my daughter. When I lost my friends in those first few weeks. But now, it's like I just take something like this in stride. Like this is what our world is now, and we'd better just get used to it. What did you want to talk to me about? I know you care about Clementine. Anyone can see that. And I know you want what's best for her. But this plan of yours, putting everyone on a boat with no destination, do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Because I don't. So I want to make you an offer. What well, kind of offer? <clears throat> I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have Not a chance. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you. I promise you. Away, That's what you want for her, isn't it? Be safe. I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away. But you ought to do it right now. I know you think you're doing what's best for her. And if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But you're not. And staying with you is not what's best for her. If no one else around here will tell you that, then I will. Yeah, but and then she shouldn't stay with you <laughs> either. You're not her father. Here. We've been through more together than you can imagine. Anyone who tries to get between me and her, anyone, is going to wind up dead. You hear me? Take your hands off. What are you going to do, old man? Lemons, time. Hey, going somewhere? Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. You should come with us. About? Kenny's working on the boat right now. Thought you were coming with us. God knows you earned it. Yeah, I've been thinking it over. It's not for me. It sounds like it'd be pretty crowded, and I never did like the water. You sure about this? I'm sure. I've always done better on my own anyhow okay fine listen i'm not much for goodbyes tell the others for me sure sure you take care of yourself molly you too lee and you be sure to take care of that little girl you know she thinks the world of you good luck Ain't nothing to do with luck. Hey, sweet pea. 
Kenny's working on the boat. Okay. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? I don't know. I don't know. We'll figure it out. We always do. Graham, honey, what's wrong? What happened to Ben? What did Kenny mean when he said you did what you had to? He didn't Damn. want me to save him. You have to believe me. I tried to save him, but Ben didn't want me to. What do you mean? What Ben did was very brave. He knew we were running out of time, and that saving him might put everyone else in danger. So he told me to leave him behind so the rest of us could get away. I know that's difficult to understand. I understand. You do? Yeah. He thought about other people before he thought about himself. My mom always told me that's what makes a good person. Well, she was right. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? Uh... I'd like to, Claire. But I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe. Clementine? Clementine! Clementine? The walkie's gone. Pardon me. How long is this? Two hours, seven minutes. Wow. Where is everyone? Hmm. I think this is the longest ever walk in that episode. Clementine? Clementine! God. Clementine's hat. X is something times in. Whoa! Yeah. I got there. Did I get. Oh no. I heard the crunch sound. Oh, I got bit. safe. Lee? Where's Clementine? She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? It's mine. Oh my god. No way. No. No fucking way. There's no time to worry about me. Clementine's gone. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? Uh, how long is this episode? Then who the hell took her? Last night, Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. 
I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? I need help. Well, may not have much time. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? We're all responsible for Clementine. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. All of our help. Damn right. We can't let you do this alone. So that's settled then. We'll look for Clementine together. Thanks, Thank you. Guys. I appreciate it. man you know I care about Clementine and I am a Christian man I keep asking myself if this was me asking you for help asking you to put your life on the line would you be there for me because there have been plenty of times when you ain't been the fuck Clementine's my family you know what Clementine I was there for your family dickhead Family's all that matters, and you were there for Koch and Duck when it mattered yeah. most, I guess. All right, guess. I'm in. Okay, guys, we should go find Vernon. See if he. I'll stay for all of it. Let's head out. What about the boat? We just gonna leave it unguarded? If someone was gonna take it, they'd have done it already. Besides, what choice do we have? <laughs> Let's go. Supplies are gone, Lee, which means they're not here. Where the hell are they? Looks like they got out of here in a hurry. Vernon! Get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. Clementine. Are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch. Holy. Who are you? Who is, is this? this? It's not Vernon, if that's what you're thinking. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Please don't hurt her. Oh, to be continued, chat. Wait on. Should show me juices. Yeah. Did you kill the boy in the attic? Yep. Did you lie or threaten Vernon? 57% of us were honest. Cool. Did you bring Clementine with you to Crawford? Wow. Did you let Ben fall to his death? 
did you reveal your bite to the group? Some people must be an idiot. Gushing. Oh, damn. 13%. Don't know what that was in the top left hand corner, but yeah. <sighs> so hot, chat. Wow. Okay. I'm thinking that's episode five. Should be. Come on. Okay, good. Yep. Okay. That is the end of his stream. Thank you for coming along. This um yep, please hit that subscribe button on YouTube. Hit that like button on YouTube and hit that follow button on my Twitch. Thank you very much and I'll see you in the next broadcast. Peace.